Welcome to the live stream, everybody. Man, we got a lot to talk about. We got a lot to talk about. The market is moving again. We have a beautiful, beautiful chart to dive into. We uh, have some announcements with Black Box. Well, not some announcements, some uh, some feedback as to what's been going on with, uh, with Black Box and our newest scalping strategy, Bang Box. Um, so let's just dive into it. We're gonna start off here taking a look the king of all crypto that is bitcoin and we've been you'll have to forgive i i almost didn't go live because of the because of the drilling in the background let me know if the drilling is too much if the drilling is too much maybe we will stop but uh yeah our, our beautiful sound studio here has construction going right next door and they're drilling into the concrete so there's not a lot i can do and i really wanted to hop on and share my thoughts so i decided to go for it anyways all right wyckoff accumulation we have been watching this for a little while now and this wyckoff accumulation continues to uh present itself continues to move forward so if you've never seen this schematic before this is a Wyckoff accumulation and we are following it tick for tick oh yeah let's get the hammering going too let's 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 get the hammers going that sounds great <laughs> please let me know if it's unbearable and unwatchable um but yeah so we're following this tick for tick and we're at the most important part this is the spring to the jump across the creek into our resistance zone so here we are with our spring let's actually turn volume on for just a moment here let's get our volume on still still kind of low volume flat volume i want to see a little bit of an increase we did get a little bit of selling volume here which is not what you want to see but you know there's there's still hope we're above this line we got a beautiful demand tail here at the lps beautiful beautiful demand tail on this lps that's what you want to see right at the creek line um so it's definitely looking good as far as the daily charts concerned let's take a look at things on the four hourly four hourly is showing an increase in volume that's a lot uh that's a lot better to see but we have this kind of a lot of people can look at this as a head and shoulders developing i want to caution people who are new to trading about head and shoulders okay what is a head and shoulders and what is an inverse head and shoulders it is a change of the trend what is more important than these you know patterns that come out is what is happening structurally and a lot of people will show you they'll be like oh my god we got we got a head and shoulders forming so it's a guarantee to to break the neckline and head down well let's just take it a little bit slower and let's look we have a high we have a low we have a higher high we have a higher low and a higher high so to me this is an uptrend it's an uptrend not a uh not a uh, head and shoulders and understanding trend and analyzing trend in my opinion is a lot more important and when you learn how to analyze trend guess what you're you're identifying these reversal patterns anyways if this was you know a shoulder a head and a lower shoulder what is that identifying it's identifying that we have a lower high so that's a change of trend same with the uh, inverse head and shoulders. If we have, you know, uh, a move down like this, what is this indicating? We have a low, we have a lower low, and then we have our first higher low. It's a change of trend. So don't get hung up on the whole cup and handle, head and shoulders, all that jazz. What is the trend doing? Because that's what you want to have the ability to identify. Four hours looking nice. You know, I have, I have nothing. I, I like the trend. We are in an uptrend on the four hour. That's all I wanna see. I think that uh, we're in a good position. Now let's talk about Bang Box. So Bang Box has had two really good trades. Um, yeah, we put 0 0.1 BTC in this bot on the 22nd. It's now the 30th 
and uh, we have 0 0.123 BTC. So it's ticking along, ticking along. You know, we got 23% added to the account in a week. 23% a week. Let me know if you guys are doing 23% per week with your trading. And uh, yeah, we, it's been it's been a pleasure. It's been a pleasure to uh, to use this bot and actually get hands on. We've been developing it for a while. If you guys are interested, if you're not already set up, just uh, join the Discord. All the links are inside of the Discord for you to get set up. And uh, moving along with that takes a few minutes. Uh, and if you've set up an API connection before, it's it's really really easy. We have videos uh, regardless. All right, let's take a look at the 15 minute. And here is why I love bang box. So, you know, the 15 minutes is where we're doing our scalping and we got a beautiful entry. We had a beautiful entry here. Um, we hit our take profit. Uh, we didn't have it set to take profit, but we had our trailing stop in place and boom, as soon as we exited the trade, as soon as we exited the trade, Bitcoin fell 5%. That's what you want to see. You know, if the trade's not going to go your way, you got to get out of the trade. So, you know, you can look at it as, oh, we gave up so much. Well, we were going for gold. You got to go for gold. We weren't going to give up the opportunity. We weren't going to give up the opportunity to just break out because we are close to a breakout. We are very close to a breakout. Um, we weren't going to give that opportunity up. So, um, you know, seeing us take out this level get out of the position there and then watch the market completely melt away that's not bad that's 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 good so um quite happy and pleased with the risk management and the performance of the bot overall um one thing i wanted to talk about let's 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 switch gears here and let's go back to the macro let's go to the daily and let's turn off all of these drawings for just a moment. Let's turn bang box off and let's take a look at alpha metrics because we got a beautiful, beautiful signal here, ladies and gentlemen, a beautiful signal right here. Green wave. Looks like I can't have it with the uh, drawings on, but the wave has just turned green. This is very, very good. For those who don't know, anytime the wave turns green, it does so before a pretty large rally. Back here, wave turned green. We got a 70% rally. Back here, the wave turned green. We got a 17% rally. Back here, the wave went green. We got a... 60% rally back here. The wave went green. We got a 70% rally again. When this wave goes green, we are fully bullish. We're already, I'm already quite bullish because of what we're seeing with this uh, Wyckoff accumulation. But on top of all of that, on top of the Wyckoff accumulation, we have alphanumetrics working for us. And uh, the market is just all the stars are aligning. Let's let's get all of our indicators back on here. All the stars are beginning to align. And we are seeing some really good uh, signs in the market that momentum is picking back up. And that's exactly what we want to see. So to all the bears out there, to everybody who didn't listen to me, um, we have a clip. You know, I was I was down here saying this is the bottom. This is the bottom. This is the spring. Everybody's calling for lower levels. The whole market is bearish. When the whole market is bearish, the whole, they're usually wrong. And uh, we went down here. I was buying. I had conviction. I was telling you to buy as well. Um, and to the bears that actually shorted this level instead of buying, well, that's what you get. That's what you get. Um, you got to take the counter side of the narrative. Always. 95% of traders lose money. Why? because they are trading with emotions and they're trading with logic. The markets are not logical. The markets are completely irrational. There's no place for logic. There's no place for emotion. Emotion is a money killer in this market. If you are an emotional person, then you are a fantastic candidate for uh, black box. Everything, as far as our products are concerned, are 100% free. Everything we offer is free. 
The only thing is that you have to trade on one of our partnered exchanges. So the exchanges pay us money. You don't pay us money. Okay. And uh, that's the way we're going to have it as it stands right now. As we grow, don't, don't dawdle on this, by the way. As we grow, we will have to start putting caps in place because our strategies are going to get too big for the order books. So if you're on the fence, at least get into the Discord and start asking questions because it's free now. It's not going to be free later. We are going to have, we're going to be forced. We want it to be free, but uh, we're going to be forced because it gets too big and the order book can't handle you know, $100 million worth of liquidity. We can't just throw $100 million worth of everybody's orders at the order book and expect to get good prices out of that. So um, just, you know, don't dawdle on this because we are giving a professional grade product away for free. Um, it's not gonna, it's not gonna last forever. So please take advantage while you can. Um, let's take a look at Bitcoin dominance for a moment. So we're still in that territory. I said, you know, until this downtrend breaks, it's an uptrend. As if, if it continues to be an uptrend, then it's going to continue to not be a favorable condition for altcoins. If you've been in the top 20 altcoins, you have not been seeing very much price performance compared to Bitcoin at all. And this is the chart. This is the reason why. Until this switches directions, which we're getting so close to resistance, everything up here is resistance. This 60% resistance, people were calling me crazy for saying we're going up to 60%. I was down here calling for 60%, and people said I was completely nuts. Well, now we're here. We've touched 60% twice. Um, this is the resistance. This is also the place at which it's going to change the trend, and then altcoin season begins. And when altcoin season begins, whoo, man, it's going to be spicy. It's going to be really, really exciting. So you definitely want to make sure you're in when that happens. Um, that's it. We're going to, I'm sorry, this didn't end up being a live stream. And, uh, you know, we're going to try and get to the bottom as to what's going on with my bit rate. I have fast internet, so I'm not exactly sure what's going on, but uh, it is what it is. So. Until next time, please, everybody, trade safe. It is a jungle out there. Have a good one.